YouTube, welcome to the video. Today we are going to be unboxing my new set of Oracle cards. I am so ready for a new set of Oracle cards, so let's get to it. Okay, you guys, so this is my Oracle card. Fun, before we continue, I do want to say this is Fox for no baby animals were hurt in the making of it. Okay, so I have a quite a few of these which I absolutely love and I felt like I was ready for a new set okay so this is how pretty it looks it's not just an oracle deck it's also a guidebook why did I buy this if I have a few already honestly they're like freaking Pokemon cards you guys once you have one deck you kind of want a whole bunch this is a really big box it is a lot bigger than any of the other Oracle decks that I have purchased. The um, price on the back says $39.99. I didn't pay that much though. It has a really cute little message on the back which I absolutely love. It says no one needs to stand between the creator and you or between you and the great powers of nature. Ooh, I love it. Look how pretty. Okay, so let's open it now. Where do I open it from? Okay, here it is. So, let's see a very careful incision. Ah, okay. Ooh, look how the look at that pretty box. Oh my goodness. This one is a lot like my tarot cards. Oh my goodness, I love this rainbow print in the back. Isn't that beautiful? It has this nice little cord right here to pull. Oh my goodness. Look at this, you guys. It's so cute. Okay, so this is the guidebook. Let's open the guidebook. So here they're sharing, you know, their books that they've written and also um, a few other card decks that they have made. That's really good to know. This is what I love about these, that you don't have to be a pro at all to know anything about Oracle cards. You just have to be an enthusiast and respect the spirituality of it. And these little guidebooks tell you exactly how to work with the deck. I love that. So what you usually do is you pull a card and then you look for your card in the book and it's going to give you three explanations of it. Okay, so why don't we do that? Let's open up the cards. Okay, ready guys? Welcome to my home and into my life. I trust you and your guidance. Oh my goodness, okay, look at that. And it comes with a little pool. That's the box. And here are the cards. Ready? Okay guys, I am back at the frame. So I'm going to take this little paper thingy off and we're going to go look through the cards. I'm going to show you a few and then let's just do a cute little card pull and see what they have to say. Okay. So this is the back of the cards. Maybe you see the size with my hand. It's actually a really nice fit. They are not as matte as my Moonology cards and they don't feel as thick, but they don't feel cheap. That's not where I'm going with it either. They have a really nice touch to them. So the first one is called the Ancient Ones. This is one of the cards. Look how pretty that is. So the reason why I went ahead and bought a new deck was I just, I felt like I had gotten everything out of my Moonology Oracle deck and I felt like I was ready to receive new messages. Alien Cross. Something that has really helped me, and I've mentioned this in the past videos, the past unboxing Oracle videos I've done, is I love to pull a card in the morning while I'm having coffee and it kind of helps me clarify anything that I have woken up with. You know, we wake up with a lot on our minds. The arrow. We go to sleep with a lot on our minds and 
I don't, a lot of people, you know, wake up and read a book. A lot of people wake up and they like to look for a nice little quote. I just like to pull a card and see what it tells me or what I should meditate on. It's just something that I've been practicing beauty way and I have been a better person. I feel like a, be a better person. I have a different outlook in life. The beloved. Ooh, look at this one, you guys. I just feel so good every time I do this and since I've been practicing this. The blade. It's the child, look how cute. The circle. The corn. The crow. This one's so cute. Okay, so you guys kind of get the point. These are just beautiful cards. I bought these because, oh my goodness, look at this one. Thunder. Look how cute this is. Okay, I'm not an expert when it comes to oracle, tarot, nothing like that. But something that did help me when I first started out is buying a deck that came with a guidebook. It teaches you about the deck. It teaches you what each card means. It teaches you how to cut the cards, bless the cards, what each spread means. Uh, it, tells, it talks to you about pulling one card a day, which is what I do over coffee every single day. It, it, it explains how to actually form a relationship with your cards. And so I'm gonna do a quick little shuffle now. And we're gonna pull a card just for fun so I can show you guys what I mean. One card pull is a great way to start. A fantastic way to start. I don't know if I mentioned already, but the reason why I wanted to buy this deck specifically was because I was ready to receive a different message. I feel like my Moonology cards were the perfect place for me to start. It gave me the perfect foundation. It helped me kind of find like my center within myself, peace within myself. These cards are really based around wisdom and beauty, which is where I kind of feel like where I'm going with in 2020. So I'm gonna shuffle. So when you get your card, you do the one card pull, so, so simple. You don't have to be a pro. You can cut the cards or you can just pick it up from the top. I'm gonna cut it. And I am going to pull the first one. You guys saw it first, what is it? The Time Master. Okay, so now after you pull your card, we're gonna look it up in the guidebook. And there it is in the book. I hope you guys enjoyed my little unboxing. Please let me know if you pick up the Oracle deck and what you think about it. If this is the Oracle deck that you have decided to go with, I will leave a link down below for you. With that said, thank you so much for watching my video. If you'd like to see more videos like this, please subscribe to my channel. Otherwise, have a beautiful night, morning, day, week, weekend, wherever you are in the world, whatever time you're watching this video. I'm just really thankful that you gave me a shot and stuck around to the very end. Have a good night, you guys. See you later.